An Indiana University mathematics professor believes he and a colleague may have found a way to modify one of Albert Einstein's equations to account for a mysterious force which won its discoverers a 2011 Nobel Prize. WTIU Stan Jastrzewski has more. Professor Shohung Wong boldly went where many had gone before, to an equation Albert Einstein created in the early part of the 20th century to explain how matter and energy coexist. But Einstein, he says, was limited by the time in which he lived. In a sense, we're not saying Einstein is wrong. Einstein just needs to be modified. Einstein is correct up to a certain uh, like, uh, time on uh, spatial scales. Here's the problem. The guy the Hubble telescope is named after, Edwin Hubble, well, he's got a law named after him, which says the universe is always expanding, and it is, but much faster than he thought. In fact, it's expanding faster all the time. That's a puzzler for physicists, because with a finite amount of energy, space shouldn't be flying apart at an increasing rate. It's like expecting a car to speed up with no gas left in the tank. But last year, Wong says three physicists won a Nobel Prize for discovering what's known as dark energy, an invisible fuel of sorts, which may make space accelerate. The task now is to take Einstein's equation and modify it to account for dark energy. If Wong and a colleague are right, they may help explain how a lot of the universe's mysterious forces work, including black holes. Wong now waits to see if the scientific community pokes holes in his theory, or if, as Hubble suggested, the universe of knowledge is truly expanding. For WTIU News, I'm Stan Jastrzewski.